welcome back. I am D I'm Dave, and there were um, last month uh, there were some updates to the site that, uh, in my opinion, weren't too significant. But uh, and I wasn't even going to make a video about them initially. But that uh, there are also some personal uh, updates I think I should let you guys know about. And so I'm going to do all of them at the same time. So first off, we have this change to the profile set uh, settings page, or there your link to. The profile page is there, so that's kind of nice for people. And uh, on this one, if uh, you, apparently if you're signing in from from Google or something, it'll, sh it'll show you that, and you can set your own regular username and password, which is really useful for people, for people. That's really the only significant thing out of that, out of those updates. And and the, and if, actually, I should have said this before, but that information is coming from. Penguin Typer, that's where I got the information from, as well as the other two updates. Now, there, apparently there was a wave of uh, b uh, temporary 14-day bans, which doesn't make sense for them to be that short, and there are still other botters there, so the problem isn't exactly solved, but it's still a step in the right direction. Then also, apparently, for, if you're going for a big session, there, there, you'll get a recapture. A test. Unfortunately, as Penguin Type pointed out, they can just uh, do th that themselves and let's let the bot run. But another thing they could also do, which is not necessary, but they could, is there are literally services where you can pay to have people uh, do the recaptures for you. That's why the new, uh, the new recapture, according to a segment of how I built this with Guy Ross. Is, uh, that now the recapture is your behavior on the site. So they can just uh, decide whether you're human from your behavior on each individual site. So before the recapture tests, you could get in into any site and be recognized as human just because of those dumb tests. It was the same, t pretty much the same test every site. But now every site has a different uh, algorithm and uh, for scoring you as whether you're human and or non-human. So oh, now it's a lot more complicated for them. Anyway, that's all the, uh, for those nitro type updates. Now time for some person uh, personal updates. It is time for personal updates, not it. So I've been wanting to hang it uh, because the leaderboards uh, should be going away. Or even if they're not. I am going to be disbanding the team, and also I changed the name to Good Riddance LBs because Good Riddance at this point. So, as soon as this person, who is the you know, only reason why I kept the team him, uh, for this long, because they were comfortable with the team, it was their first team, they, they wanted to keep it, so, so I was like, okay, we all keep it for you. Because, uh, hey, for all, I know, for all I know, this is a kid just starting out in Nitrotype. Yeah, but how would it make them have a good experience? But now they haven't raced in 25 days, so if they get removed by the Nitrotype thing, with, or the Nitrotype members being removed after 30 days, if they're removed, then I'll pretty much just disband the team. So that's why I closed this, so no more applications or anything. I will probably be returning to this person's team, JACS, which and my alt account is also on, which uh, I believe you have seen before. Anyway, I think that's all I wanted to cover today. Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next, next one. Oh, one more thing. On December uh, on December sixth uh, at nine o'clock uh, Central Time, I will be you know doing a challenge where if I lose a race, I cheer ten bits on a, a Twitch live stream. Uh, any Twitch live stream that uh, is either in my followers list or just happens to be live at the moment. Uh, so that'll be fun. You can race with me. Uh, anyway, else I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, see you on the next one. Goodbye.